Figure 1 shows a metal cube which is expanding uniformly as it is heated. At time t seconds the length of each edge of the cube is x centimetres and the volume of the cube is v centimetres cubed. Show that dv dx equals 3x squared. Given that the volume v centimetres cubed increases at a constant rate of 0.048, find dx dt when x equals 8. Find the rate of increase of the total surface area of the cube when x equals 8. So let's have a look at this then. So part A. So here the volume then. Let's write that down. The volume of the cube is length times breadth times height, which is x cubed. So dv dx then, differentiate with respect to x. Power rule, 3x squared. That's part A. V increases at a constant rate of 0 0.048. So part B dx dt. So find dx dt. So dv dt then is equal to dv dx using the chain rule times dx dt. So that tells us that dv dt which is 0 0.048 and we can write that as 48 over a thousand is equal to dv dx which is 3x squared times by dx dt. So, dx dt then is equal to, move this 3 underneath, so the 3, 48 and the 3 will cancel to leave 16 on top, and the 1000 is underneath, and the x squared also comes underneath. At x equals 8 then, dx dt is equal to, okay, 16 over 8 squared, 16 over 1,000 times 8 squared. So that would be 1 over 4,000, wouldn't it? One of the 8s will go, and it's 2 over 8 that's left, which is 1 over 4, times 1,000 is 1 over 4,000, which is equal to 0 0.000025 centimeters squared cubed uh, dx dt rather so centimeters per second so there's dx dt for part b find the rate of increase of the total surface area of the cube when x equals 8 so the surface area let s be the total surface area we've got six sides of a cube, haven't we? Each side is x times x in area, so s is equal to six lots of the area of each side, six x squared. Okay, then s is equal to that, so what have we got then? Well, find the rate of increase of the total surface area, so we want ds dt is equal to, now this is now a function of a function, so it's 12x to the 1 multiplied by dx differentiated with respect to dt. So, um, okay, dx dt we know is uh, 16 over 1000 x squared. So ds dt then is equal to 12x times 16 over 1000x squared. That's what we've got there. Okay, 12x times dx dt, and we've said 16 over 1000x squared. That looks okay. So what does that equal to then? Well, that goes down to 2. Oh, when x is 8, rather. Let's put in x equals 8. So we've got 12 times 16 over 1,000x, which equals, now I'm going to put the value in, 12 times 16 over 1,000 times 8. 8 goes into 16 twice. So we've got 24 over 1,000. Which equals 0.0. .0 to 4 and that's centimeters squared per second 
of when x was 8, wasn't it? When x equals 8. And there's the rate of increase of the surface area.